Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we'll look at how we can connect a Linux Mint virtual machine that's installed on VMware Workstation to a Wi-Fi network. We'll need to make a few changes that will allow us to connect our machine to a Wi-Fi network. Now, in this case, I'm using a Wi-Fi or wireless adapter to make the connection that's connected to the host machine. And I'll provide a link to the kind of adapter I'm using in my description. Now, the first thing we need to do before we power on our machine is to do one setting change. So we'll click on the uh, virtual machine here, right click on it and go to settings. Then we want to change, we want to make sure the network adapter is set to bridged under network connections. So just make sure you have this selected. The rest you can leave at the, we can leave the, the rest at default. Once you have that selected, just click OK. And then we'll power on the machine. Now I'll power this machine on and I'll come back once it's done with the boot up. Now the machine is done booting up and I've logged into it. So we are on the desktop here. We can begin by checking our IP address. So down here, I'll click on the terminal. And then I'll, I'll run the command IP address to see what interfaces are showing right now. Uh, as you can see, we only have two interfaces, the loopback and then the uh, wired uh, interface, which is an, has an IP of 172.16.1.102. And we are not seeing anything that says Wi-Fi or wireless. So we don't have Wi-Fi connection. Now we will make some setting changes here to connect to our Wi-Fi network. Before I do the uh, setting changes, I'm going to connect my uh, USB uh, wireless adapter to my host machine. So once I have it plugged in, we'll, we'll go ahead and uh, make the settings changes. So I have it plugged in, and as you can see, there's a pop-up window saying, new USB device detected. I'm going to select the option to connect to a virtual machine, second option, and then I'll select uh, Linux Mint. I'll click OK, and then it's just telling you in, this is the kind of uh, device it has seen, removable device. So, so I'll click OK here. Uh, as you can see here, because I was connected to this before, it's prompting me for uh, a password to log into my Wi-Fi network. I'm going to X this out, X this out, and then we'll see what option we need to check first. Now. If you go to the menu and uh, type in network, to so open the network network settings, I'm, I'm showing my available networks here, Wi-Fi network. If you haven't set up your USB wireless adapter, you, you're not going to see this option here, Wi-Fi. If it's your first time setting it up, this is going to be just the wired and then pro network proxy, you'll not see anything that says Wi-Fi. Before you can get that option, so before you can get the Wi-Fi options that we saw under the network settings, you'll need to right click on your virtual machine here, the status bar, and then go to removable, removable devices. And then you'll need to find your wire, uh, USB wireless adapter. And in my case, this is the one right here. And then you'll need to co click on uh, connect right here. Once you have that done, then you'll be able to get that option under network uh, settings. So once you have that setting done, come back here and do a search for your network settings. And actually you can right click on this and pin to panel so that you don't have to search for it again. And now when you open this window, you should have your Wi-Fi options show up here. And then you should have a list of the Wi-Fi networks within your range, including your Wi-Fi network. At this point, all you can do is select your Wi-Fi network. And then you'll need to put in your password for that network. So I'll go ahead and put in a, my password and I come back. Once you have, you're done putting in your password, just click on connect. And then you should see this spinning icon right here as it's trying to connect to your Wi-Fi network. And once it's connected, you see a check mark here, a tick indicating that you're connected. Now we'll go back to our terminal and uh, 
see if we are getting an IP from our wireless uh, router. So I'll open the terminal again. I'll do the up arrow for the IP address command. And as, this time, as you can see here, we have an additional network adapter, which starts with a WL. So this is for our wireless network. And as you can see here, we actually do have an IP that we received via DHCP from our wireless router. And the IP is 192.168.1.172. So that shows us that we have we have been able to connect to our Linux Mint virtual machine to our wireless network. So that's all for this video. I hope this is uh, helpful. I'll catch you all in my next video. Thanks. Bye.